Okay, okay. Hi, Leos. I hope you are doing well. Thank you so much for joining me. This is A Touch of Tarot. Today, we're going to do a reading for your person's feelings, intentions, and next move. Um, let's see what's going on with the description first so you can see if this is your person. Wow. Okay, so first of all, we're dealing with someone who likes to rescue people, okay? So this person, let's put the bully first, and then the damsel in distress energy, and then the rescuer. So I feel that your person is, pro and then look at the magno magnet magnumous. I'm not saying that right, but I just noticed the mega, right? So this person is big masculine energy, okay? And they kind of have to be because this person likes to rescue others. That can be a positive, that can be a negative. Um, but this person is someone who may have rescued a, a, another. That may be how you uh, can identify that this reading is for you. Um, this person could have saved a woman from an abusive relationship, or it could be someone who even works with people that have been abused, children, uh, the helpless, you know, people that just can't help themselves or can't like speak for themselves, right? It even says here verbal or physical abuse. So this person could be a counselor, someone that works with women that are hurt. Um, this person is someone who sees the beauty in everything. Everything is beautiful. That's beautiful energy you have here. This is a big a big teddy bear. Okay. That's what I get here. Like, even if this person looks super big or seems super tough sometimes when they stand up for, for others that are unable to stand up for themselves, this person helps people see the beauty in themselves. This person also helps people look at their own reflection. And that could be also with the intimidation. When someone intimidates others, this person comes and intimidates them. That's interesting. So description, blonde hair, black hair, long hair, clean shaven, um, bushy face even, you know, some of the very curly facial hair for someone. Um, could be anything or anyone, any description, okay? So let's see what we're getting for feelings here. Um, we'll start here, right? We'll start with this for now. So this person's feelings and their intentions interesting we have the nine of cups and it's in reverse i mean i always like to just take a note of that message but i actually feel like this person is coming for you you don't realize that that's their intentions um right now you're just trying to you know for some of you right now you're in an abusive relationship yourself maybe you haven't even met this person but i feel like for majority of people on my channel you've met this person this could have been a fresh relationship that didn't really go that far. Some of you, I don't know, there's something here where you're hurt. Oh, your heart is hurt. So for some of you, you may feel like you, um, you're just bored in life. You're don't, like, when is your love coming in? When is this person coming in? Maybe you feel like this person is more focused on helping everyone else type of thing. Um, 27 maybe a number 52 17 27 twice here so that's number nine you're holding on waiting for this person this person touched your heart but i feel like this person may not have been quite ready tristan may be someone's name so this is what i think i think maybe for some of you this person helped you really i don't know you become a new you or something like that like breathe a fresh breath of air in your life um, and now you're wondering where this person is or something like that. So you're wondering what actions this person will be taking. You're wanting this person to come near you. Um, I'm not sure why this person hasn't, to be honest. For some of you, your energy, this person is in pause. So you just kind of let to have to let this person breathe <laughs> themselves here. Um, I know you want a heart-to-heart -heart conversation, but... Right now is not the time to chase or to send too much energy this way. This is protected. Um, every project turns to gold. This is your person right now. Magnanimous me. Interesting. Um, so this is the Midas touch right now. So maybe this person is really helping other people. Let's see what we have here.
Okay, so this person is going to want to start fresh with you, or maybe they've already said this to you at some point, okay? It says your deep eyes haunt me, so this person cannot let you go. And then look at this. It says, I love you, but don't wait for me. Uh, you know, it's not the, the best, but this person is being honest here. Of course, don't wait. You know, I find you extremely attractive. We have love here, and this totals a 10 of cups. So I think that this person has future plans for this connection. So I'm excited for a new beginning. Yes, in the upright. What's the number here? Number three. So let's see what else we're getting. Maybe this will tell us some more. But this person's uh, feelings for you, this person thinks you're a goddess. Look at this pregnancy. This person, ooh. <laughs> this person wants to have a child with you. I don't know why all of those cards just fell over. Some of you saw that. Okay. Sorry, guys. Okay. So let's see. What is this one over here? It's a random one. You are my first true love. Wow, that's interesting. Okay, you're this person's first true love. For those of you that this person just ran off, let's see why. What happened? What's caused some space here between the two of you? For some of you, like maybe you're pregnant at this time. I don't know. I left to get clean. So this person could be an addict, plain and simple. It is what it is. Maybe that's why this person is always helping other people. Maybe you met this person in a half, I don't know why I was about to say halfway house, but, um, you know, an addiction house, somewhere where they help people. So let's see what else we get here. And then look at what's at the bottom. I didn't even notice that, but we have that healing and healed energy. So this person could be healing themselves right now. Maybe they don't want to tell you about it. Maybe they like to come off so strong, like everything is perfect. Um, and this person has an addiction of their own. I feel very guided to get that card for you. Oh, wow. I see why it was a yes. So that could be saying that, yes, that's true. What I was just saying. But if you had a question, like, does this person care about you? Absolutely. This person definitely cares about you, but I feel like they're either trapped in their addiction or trapped in some sort of a situation right now, maybe helping, maybe healing others. Maybe this person is taking care of other people's addiction. Okay. Like we can't just take the exact wording of the card. But this person could be healing other people. And, and the reason why we can't take the exact wording like, and be so stuck on it is because there's so many people on here. So we have to be really flexible, flexible with the messages, okay? So this person, you know, they definitely, I think when this person thinks of you or finally looks at you, they want to be with you, right? But right now with the energy, if you're pushing this person especially, right now this person has their hands tied up. Plain and simple. It really is what it is. And that's why they'll just say, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I love you, but don't wait for me. Just to keep it, like, they got to keep on going, right? Let's get another. I don't know if I was using these cards now. <laughs> it's okay. So some of you may be dealing with a Taurus as well is what I just heard. So I'll make more time. I'll do it. So it says, you don't understand. These are my cards and they have multiple messages, by the way. You don't understand what it's like to walk away from someone who has such a hold, acts helpless and knows so much, the hanged man. So this could be the fact that this person's working with other people. Um, maybe they're always saying to, the, to work, I'll make more time, I'll make more time and just continually giving time to help people that act helpless, you know, because they may be addicts, the damsels, or they may not be like, you know, if they are very able to take care of themselves for some of these people, but this person gets stuck on them. It's like he rescues these people and they get stuck on him. Maybe they look at him as, or her as a father or mother, if it's a, a female you're dealing with. So let's just see what this person's next move is. Wow, that's a, a strong message. Okay, Leo. So look at here we go. We're helping more people again. Working with others, right? Sacrificing their time and energy. Look at that. For a greater cause, I guess we could say in this case. Giving their energy to the small fishies. Okay. That's what I get. Well, you can expect contact from this person. You can, 
And this per- there's something that this person's going to, that's going to happen in this person's life. Maybe they're going to help people. Maybe they're building a new home. Um, and this home can like shelter the needy or shelter people in another country. I'm hearing like Africa or something like that, where they need help. Maybe this is a doctor, you know, that you're dealing with. Look at, and I just cut it at the death card. So this person, look at, is trying to help support people that need, um, some sort of help, you know, they could be really not going through good times. This is a worldly person. So I feel like there's going to be some sort of a celebration in this person's work. Something is going to be complete. And maybe then they can finally keep their word and come to you. I think right now you might be left in the dark here. So why did this person leave you in the dark? Let me just see that, you know. Well, I don't think they did it purposely whatsoever. I actually think that for some of you watching this video, you're letting your mind take over a bit. You have like some air energy in you or something like that. Because you're wondering why this person is not doing more. Something like that, right? Um, so this person's next moves. I do see moves being made. Yeah, I just saw the page and now it goes to the night. This person is going to come towards you, but there's something that's going on. I think it's after they have a celebration of some sort. Look at this strength. It's getting rewards with that. Something this person has worked hard for. That's what I'm getting, you know. But yeah, okay, they're coming back around, but you've been left in the dark for some reason. It's interesting because this person has such great character. Why would this person leave you in the dark so much? What's going on here? And the one thing I can say is maybe because this person does have an addiction. And even look at this. I mean, the magician can be dealing with a lot of different things. And addiction could be one of them. I'm also seeing the Wheel of Fortune. And look at it again, the death card. This person may have also lost someone that he loved. And it could actually be a man. So that could have happened recently. I am getting this like hospital doctor energy, right? So maybe this person just hasn't told you yet. Um, but I do see that this person intends to reach out to you is the best way I can put it. So let's get a message from the universe. It's hmm. a lot. We're just going to take... This is someone who's like uh, very, I want to say almost wealthy or something like that, okay? Merkaba. The frequency of Merkaba supports our ability to use our consciousness to traverse into other layers of reality and dimensions. It activates our access to our Akashic inheritance as well, merging the totality of our experiences into the, our present to serve our highest purpose. This person could be going... I don't know, through some huge growth right now with that birth energy as well, right? Okay, so I'm going to leave it there. This person will be coming in to contact you in one way or another. They're going to take actions towards you as well. Uh, yes, but this person is really always helping others. And to be honest, these people need to help themselves. This person may have some addictions that they have to take care of and heal. A lot of healing energy needed here. But that's good. That is the message for now. Thank you so much, Leo. Your message, I don't know, it was pretty, it was pretty nice if you ask me. Bye for now.